update in developing news in New Haven. Just in time for the morning rush, 91 southbound has just reopened after a rollover crash. Yeah, so we're going to get straight out to Channel 3 Eyewitness News reporter Olivia Schuler. She's live off of exit 9 right in New Haven. Olivia, what do we know right now? Kaylin and Nicole, we know that one person was seriously injured and taken to the hospital. It's a quiet morning here in New Haven, but if you can see that overpass just over my shoulder, you'll see that cars are moving uh, as normal, and that southbound lane on I-91 has completely reopened. Now, there's a lot we're working to find out this morning. I've contacted state police to ask them how many cars were involved and if there were any injuries in the crash. You're looking right now at an eagle's eye view of the crash on I-91 south in New Haven from 2 o'clock this morning. You can see a number of first responders investigating the rollover crash. We know around 10 o'clock last night, emergency services, the fire department, and state police responded to the crash. This means that crews were investigating for several overnight hours. Now, once again, I-91 South here in New Haven has completely reopened. However, we're still waiting to get more details from Connecticut State Police about this crash to learn if there were any other injuries other than that one person we currently know about. As soon as we have that information for you. You'll be the first to know. We're live this morning in New Haven. Olivia Schuler, Channel 3 Eyewitness News.